Derby for life. I'm here today gonna pick a car that's gonna go to a derby. Uh, this derby is not till uh, August. Yeah, it's in August, like mid-August. I think there's one early August, but I haven't found it and I think it might have been canceled. But I know for sure that there's one in mid-August or like kind of towards late August. Um, I haven't decided if it's going to happen or if it's going to, if it happens, I definitely will go. But if it doesn't, oh well. But today, I'm going to pick a car to go to that derby. Uh, this class is a stock class. Um, there is, uh, like, it's basically a gut and go. There's no adding stuff. There's no swapping out parts. There's stock bumpers, I believe. Um, basically, it's stock. Like, you basically move the gas tank, maybe put a cage in, and go. Go have fun. And I have never done one of these classes. I'm actually excited to try this. And this is a compact class, so I'm taking one of my Luminas. So, which Lumina are we going to take? Um, the choice is between these four. Um, so this is a stock class, um, very stock show, very little stuff you can do. So I'm going to decide which one would be the best one to bring. Um... Kind of sucks that that one's no good. That would have been the one I would have took to the stock class just to have fun. I didn't want to waste one of my Luminas, but here we are. <laughs> so we're going to decide. I know these four run and drive. I unloaded that one. I drove that one in a race and then the fuel pump went out. This one runs and drives. This one runs and drives. So we're going to decide which one to take to the stock class. What I would like to do is actually save these two. I think I wanna save these for a more pro show, more, more uh, not pro show, but more built show. I think these would be better to take. So I'm actually deciding between these two here. I know if I take one of these, which um, this one just needs, uh, what does this one need? Um, just better gra battery cables and stuff. Like that's all I think that this one needs. So I'm thinking that this might be the candidate to bring. Um, I gotta check the rules again, see what I can all do. Um, as you can see, Someone started creasing this fender. I think that's not allowed. Uh, it's probably not allowed. Um, I think I can weld the door shut. Everything's chained basically too. But I'm thinking this one will be the one that I bring. Or this one. But the only thing that I did to this one is when I was goofing around and kids are breaking out my windows. Naughty, naughty. They weren't supposed to be doing that. But the only thing is I goofed up this back end. Um, there's like, this is, this is basically, if you look at it as a pre-ran car. So it's gonna be going forwards the whole time. Um, that's why I'm actually thinking about saving this one cause this one's more full, like it's more it's not all, well, missing half the back end. Um, and the frame on this is very junk. So I think this one would be the best candidate to bring. What I'm actually thinking about doing is I take the skid loader, pull everything out, find the trunk lid, shove it inside there, and basically build around it. And then maybe drop this speaker deck a little bit or something. But, I mean, right now it's all going in. Because my, my what happened was my buddy decided to... I got stuck on a stump with one of my derby cars when I was goofing around. And he thought it was a good idea to hit full throttle with the back end. 
So this sucker pushed in on this side. I, th I mean, at least it's going in. That's all I can say. But what I'm actually thinking about doing is pulling this out, shove the trunk landed side there, just to get some more sheet metal in there and call it good. Kind of strap it all in and whatnot. Um, I don't think, yeah. I mean, there's nothing really else I can do besides just try to pull this out the best I can. So I'm thinking this is going to be the candidate. Um, so this will, this one I think will probably be my best option to bring for this stock show. This one is not much better, but she should be good enough to use for, for a derby too. Or at least another stock show or just whatever. Um, but I think the only thing that this thing needs is... It's got a good 305 in it, or not 305, it's got a good running motor in it, The lot, it just needs a fuel pump, that's the only thing that it needs, which I move my gas sinks anyway. Um, what I want to try to do is see if I can sneak my custom built rods in there. Um, I welded some re-rod on those, and then that's going to make it a lot stiffer. So maybe that will be something I could sneak in there, but we'll see. But I think this is going to be the candidate to bring, um, for the stock show anyway. I don't know, what do you guys think? Candidate number one, number two, number three, or number four? I would like to bring one of these two. I would like to save those for another run, or for a better kind of built class. I think that would be my best option. I would like to bring that one or this one, which I'm leaning towards this one just because it's already ran basically. And I think it would just be easiest to just pull everything out, shove something in it, make it a little stiffer in the back and go from there. I don't know. What do you guys think? But there you go guys, there's what's kind of the idea of what's gonna be happening within this next month. So one of these two cars will be on the next build series. Uh, thank you guys for watching my videos, appreciate it. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe button if you're new to the channel and we'll catch you guys all in the next one.